Hey guys, how are you? It's Marisa. How you doing? I don't have my little regular mic today, but I just wanted to come on here real quick and um, this video is a little hard for me to make. I wanted to give you a little uh, background here, a nice background, but this video is a little hard for me to make today. Um, I just wanted to give you a little update on the whole podcast thing that I was supposed to be doing yesterday. Uh, I was supposed to be interviewed and stuff like that. And, um, you know, I think I prepared really well. Um, you know, I had a nice outfit and I even you know, got my nails done, my hair. I got new makeup, all this stuff, right? And I knew about this for like, the actual date for about two weeks, and I was nervous, but like throughout the whole two weeks, I was like, I could do this, I could do this, I could do this, right? And I wasn't too nervous the last couple of weeks. Um, like on Saturday, I had spent the day with my son, and I was getting nervous, like, oh my God, it's the next day, right? But I still enjoyed the day. I wasn't like harping on it. All right, so this is what happened. Uh, if you don't know, I am terrified of public speaking. I don't even like taking photographs. I know this sounds stupid because I'm literally taking a video right now of my face, right? doesn't make sense in some respects. But it's like when other people give me all the attention on me is when I start freaking out. I don't know why. Um, I actually had a memory of this first time happening to me when I was little. I was like five, six years old. And um, they were saying happy birthday to me and I started crying. I don't understand why, but it happened. Um, yeah, I don't like like people taking pictures of me, like like pose pictures. Like if people take pictures of me and I'm not like paying attention, those are like the best pictures because they're natural, right? And you would think, okay, Marie, so you are on here all the time. You know, sometimes you show your face, sometimes you, most of the time you don't. But you're taking video, you're on YouTube, right? And um, the only thing I could say about that is, is that it's different because it's just me. And like at the, in this moment right now, I'm here alone and I'm holding my own camera. Um, you know, and I feel fine. I don't feel nervous or anything. But it's, it was a situation where I was going to be interviewed. So um, there were like professional cameras there. There was lighting. It was a studio. So, and I, I cannot tell you how many times I have actually gotten out of doing like oral presentations, like in school. I can't even tell you what I did to get out of it. I've done 20 page essays. Uh, on Vincent van Gogh's, I think it was the night cafe, so that I wouldn't have to do like a five minute oral presentation. Um, I have said no to so many different things and gotten out of so many different things, you know, when it was like anything to do with like standing in front of a group of people. And I think that is like a fairly, I think a lot of people have stage fright or, you know, stuff like that. Um, but you know, this was like a really great opportunity. So like I was getting about to get ready yesterday. I was in the shower and I literally just broke. I just broke. I had emotional breakdown and the fear took over me and I canceled. So all I could say is that, you know, I of course apologize to them. Um, they were very understanding, both Yvette and Peter, you know, uh, that's my friend, you know, she was going to be, in my own friend was going to be interviewing me. Like, I should have been fine, right? Nope. She was like, Marisa, but, you know, we don't even have to interview you. It wasn't even that. It was like the cameras in my face. It was just, I can't even explain it. The fear was so bad that I literally broke down. So I didn't do it. So I'm really obviously disappointed in myself. I feel really bad. Uh, yes, to the rest of the day I spent... I want to get into it. I was not feeling good. Let's put it that way. 
So I didn't do it. So, you know, I, I apologize to you guys. I really wanted to, you know, share this with you. Um, but I also wanted to be honest that, um, you know, I guess I'm human. You know, like everyone has fears uh, that I have quite a few <laughs> with them. Um, but, yeah, no, everyone was really supportive, um, you know. They, Peter and Yvette were like, no worries, don't worry about it, we understand. Like, they already knew I was nervous beforehand, so it wasn't like this was out of the blue. But to me, it was like last minute, me canceling. It was the day of, I canceled. Uh, yes, it was four and a half hours, like, before the actual time I had to be there, but doesn't make a difference. So I feel really bad. I feel really bad that I missed an opportunity. I regret it, um, and I wish I could have worked through my fear. Um, in order to do this. So, you know, my son said something like, if I'm going to continue with YouTube, I'm going to have to deal with this. And like, he was, he didn't understand, like, you make videos all the time. You were in front of the camera. What's the difference? And the difference is there's no one here staring at me making this video. It's just me and you guys. But you're not here, like, in front of me. Like, you know what I'm saying? There's not over, over 200 people in this room right now staring at me like with cameras and it's there's a difference to me there's a difference um but you know he was like listen if you're going to continue to do this you're going to have to get help like with your fear and i agree so you know i'm going to try and work on that and you know that's really it i you know i apologize um i couldn't do this and that's about it, I guess. I just wanted to kind of share that with you. I'm trying not to cry because I feel really bad. I feel really disappointed. Um, this was a great opportunity for me and my art. And it was like something really good happened and then I couldn't do it. So I feel disappointed. So, you know, it is what it is. Just look at my tree for a second. Isn't that pretty? I still didn't put the star on. Anyway... <laughs> It'll be going up today. But um, anyway, so that's it, guys. Um, today I have to take my mom to the doctor again. Uh, just another checkup for something else. And um, tomorrow I will be back doing some uh, painting. So I hope everyone has a beautiful, beautiful day. I know I always say good morning, but I know a lot of you guys are like, um, sorry, I hit the uh, wrong button. Anyway, I must have hit the button by accident. Um, anyway, I just want to say hi, tell you what happened, be honest about it. And, um, you know, I hope that if another opportunity comes, I could, by that time, I could actually work through my fear of being on camera, of just, like, having the attention on me. I have to find out, like, where it stems from. And right now, I really don't know what. Uh, the fear is where it comes from. I don't know. I really don't. Um, yeah. So uh, as far as I know, I always had it. Always had it. I didn't really think to work on it because it's not like I had so many opportunities where I would be like, you know, the center of attention. So, you know, that's that. Anyway, like I was saying, I usually say good morning. Um, it's actually the afternoon now. But I know a lot of you guys are from all around the world, so it could be all different time zones. So, you know, wherever you are, I hope you have a wonderful day or night or morning. And I will see you guys tomorrow with some more painting. Okay? Have a beautiful day, guys. Bye.